back by Mia. He's just listening, counting the footsteps, calling it in. Some die young, or SDY if you prefer, you're gonna be spotting them from the plateau. That's a pretty good kill, but there comes the execute. Mia takes one. Nice flick. Oh my god, with a triple on top. That worked textbook for him. Absolutely perfect execution. Normally when you set up that kind of play, you could get Spray continues to go through. Some damage put out there. Chopper with the perfect timing to take down Sip and that causes a lot of problems. Glaive you're gonna get shot in the back. He actually did get two kills. Just with the kill as well on Chopper and just like that, it's a two on three. I don't know how Spirit have ended up in this position because they should have been able to, to just stand tall and wait for Chopper and somehow Glaive snuck in a double kill. Some guy young coming through and get a good spray down Dexter as well. Will drop Mega Skin. Now it's Dupree on his own. One versus two. And coming out with a P250. Magus is gonna start to fall back into the back of the bomb site here. He's got some teammate with him up in the window. But actually, no. Glaive. Maybe he got flashed or maybe he just gave up on it. Either way, it's gonna be a pretty fast execute into the bomb site. Magix, on the other hand, is burning on for a long time in the Molotov. That's a bit scary. To give up any free AKs here. That's a smooth headshot though. To bring down Sip. Now a two on five. Should be able to clean it up. They find Glaive, and they're gonna find Lucky. But oh, he snuck in another kill. That's pretty. See how much they actually throw into it. If they're not sensing that there's much on the other side, Glaive is here. Dupree has a, has a Molotov. He doesn't die. If you get interesting, the spray down is so good. The timing on that peak for Astralis is near perfect. Mia comes in with a kill, but he has to get another one. It's not going to be possible. I think he was turning around. The bomb is already planted. Spirit have got the bomb site for free, basically. Just using three smokes and a flashbang. And now here they come out the middle as well. Dexter with a big double. They get completely blindsided. Sip trying to bring it back. It is a 2 on 3 and he will add one more headshot to bring it into a 1 versus 3. SDY on his own name. His feet already and he's down. Sip wrecking havoc in the round with a quad kill. Man, was that decisive. The uh, flow going their way. Two rounds in a row picked up for Astralis. Full buy on their side. It's a full eco from Spirit. And here we go. Early flank into upper. There's the crunch. Nowhere to go for Spirit. Perfectly done by Astralis. Man, Anders, that, that's some real flat things. Three versus five. Secondary objective is just to do a lot of damage. Get three kills in this round if you're on the spirit side. Don't let him get away. It's close to a flawless round here. Some die young will get the kill on Glaive at the very least. The bomb is still pretty far back. So two versus four challenge. So interested to see how that's going to be playing out as well. Dupree and me are about to clash in the middle. And the angle is just so much better. Dupree, you could tell from the way that he was positioning that crosshair. He thought he was going to take a fight against someone up on the catwalk on the teeth. Yeah, the, that's got to be the best usually, I've seen it work. Usually they don't actually do that much. But this was amazing. Megis going to be sneaking yeah. in. And they line up. He just sprays straight headshot to take down Mir to follow up on Megis can... I guess it's a battle for their names right now. Mag Magus versus Magus. Listen, I'm just saying that. Magus can say it with a, with a Danish accent, you know? Oh, he almost could have had it. That would have been absolutely godlike, especially if he could have had the two for one. But he was in a, in a pretty tough one versus three, so it doesn't really work out. He's going to give another round to Astralis. This Never mind. Now they know there's a double orb in play because they've heard both of them ring out, so... That's something to think about. Mia actually going to try and see if he can find it. He's going to find Lucky, but he's a little bit too quick on the trigger. Great double kill for Lucky. Magic's going to come in with a kill on Glaive. The mid hit shot from Top Chopper, but he's on his hold on to the bomb site right now. And Zip, a lot of this is riding on him. He needs to open up Catwalk. They need to be pretty quick about it. They're actually running out of time rapidly. Some die young goes down. Chopper and Dexter left. Grid hit shot from top chopper, but he's on his own. Three of them. He's just has to hold for a couple of seconds. They need to get on that bomb. And oh, no, he's out of bullets, but it doesn't matter. He's going to win the round anyway. Excellent spray from chopper. If he had more bullets, he would have finished the whole. Gone, could have gone wrong there before they were going to run out of time for the GPU. So that's a bit interesting. Magic's making the way down. Flashed all over the place, but Dupree, he was not flashed at all. At Able all. to get the kill there, and again, they try to go out long, but they kind of get shut down. Not as brutally. Chopper's got the angle right now. It's a good one, too. Looks all the way to T-spawn. Oh, no. <laughs> what is that? Oh, man, it's worth <laughs> it. It is worth it because that, because that can absolutely work. We're going to see another run boost here. Uh, Glaive has pushed up for Dark as well, so there's a timer on this. Yeah, going to send him flying. He goes straight down. Otherwise, it would have been the Magic's trick, but you know, it didn't work this time. It's a real sad, sad moment here for the commentators. Glaive with a little bit of a spray, no bomb plant. He's, he's everywhere right now, Glaive, and it shows there. 
but they have leaned towards this side of the map in the most perfect way you could imagine. They got th three people on the bomb site. They're running into Spirit on the catwalk, and it's going to be an even trade to start with. But are they going to realize how many people are here? Lucky to get one kill. Ducks right up into Mir and that AK-47. But now Sip has shown up. 17 seconds on the clock. Dupree still hiding out, and Goosey's going to get one kill. And Mir... He's on his own on the bomb site here. Oh, and he gets shut down. Sip just finds the top of his head. And even headshots across the map with a, with a Tech 9. What's See, Tech 9 is making a slow comeback. I love I'm, it. I'm really enjoying it. I like that. Oh, sorry. Sip That's actually enough. back here. You see how they spread out as well? That's really cool. That's a nice little detail. Uh, none of them are facing one behind the other. Can get in without being seen. Speaking of which, Zipnix, he's trying to play a little bit of a clever angle. Does back off. Sees that nade coming through. And now he needs to get some damage in. Not going to find a kill, but that sets it up for Dupree. Triple for Dupree. Doing the work. That is everything they needed right then and there. The Molotov to slow them down in front of that B hallway as well. Absolutely made the difference too. 28 seconds now for Dexter to try and get something done. It would be a tremendous punch if he could get it, but I'm wondering if they even going to let him get the bomb down here. To fake it out a single time, waiting for someone to go. They're on the other side. He tries for it one more time, and all three of them show up. So a 10 to 5 first half in favor. Move forward or try to rotate all the way back. Oh, it's going to be a deep flashbang here. Mega setting it up. Oh, they're so blind. The duelies. Probably not going to. Oh, wait. They come back with the vision and Dexter with a double kill. It doesn't matter. Astralis. They had a godlike flashbang, but they, they converted no kills behind it. That is so rare. I think maybe one of them wasn't flashed and just got the early kill. That's what made the difference here. The dualies will reign supreme, and it's going to be Spirit winning the pistol round. That is... Well, Glaive has already got a tag in the middle with the scout on Sundai Young. Another one there on Chopper. He wants to keep pushing. Oh, that is aggressive. That is combat scouting and a headshot on Dexter. What is wrong with Glaive? I'm pretty sure there's two walls between us, but I'm pretty sure I just heard the analyst howl at that headshot. He just he just came swinging into this round. Absolutely unbreakable confidence. He nearly finds that headshot as well. Megas is in a lot of trouble up there. He's going to get the kill on his namesake, but um, still going to be traded right back. Now a two versus three. SDY and Mir both coming up catwalk, and the bomb is going to be planted here. That scout is still alive on Glaive, and he's coming back for more. Almost spotting that face. They've got to be terrified right now. There it is. Another one on Sunday Young. And See, now they've got the money. They've got the rifles. They get to just bully Team Spirit. Spirit have gone for a 4-5. Oh, the biggest gun on the wall. Disaster. That is the worst. Oh, nice. Done, though, by Mir. It's because he'd already thrown the, the, the Molotov down, and he just he is, he's assuming it's going to hold them back for a little bit. But they, they were ready. They put it out with a smoke, and they flashed their way through, and they just catch him in that corner. Really good stuff. Four on three, though. Stral is making the trek across there while the smoke is still up. Yeah. At least an AK into play. Sip with that one. Chopper walking up behind him. That's an easy spray down. Sip all on his own. One versus three. No bomb plant yet. They are fighting him. Got to be careful you don't fight him too early again. This is Sipnix we're talking about. He's got a bit of a history of winning rounds like these. Unlikely as it is, spotting them down long. And I'm not saying they should leave him alone because, but, but he has to go back and pick up the bomb. So please don't fight him out of the open too much. Oh, he's failing a little bit with that one. And Chopper will go down, but they'll win the round. And Spirit, you need to shut down Mir. He can be a real threat if uh, he starts to feel the game. <laughs> oh, but we are going to get the buy coming through. And it's already a man advantage for Astralis. Glaive is ready, though. The top is on the other side, and he was getting flashed in. That's why he turned. Mm -hmm. Sunday Young in the middle was setting up that flashbang, so it wasn't like chop. Survey is done. It's clean. Yeah, there's no, there's no oil, but it's a free bomb side. Oh, Young has been found. Vegas will take him down, so they can't even... It looked a little grim. You know, you're kind of just pulling at the collar, like, going like, you know, if this is the Astralis in the major... Yeah. Different feeling right now. Lucky that isolated, I was about to say, but um, they, they have some people behind it. I actually thought they were, they were starting already to gravitate towards the B-bomb site. But here we go. They cleaned it up. They set up for a B-hit. Yeah. Chopper, though, with a really good move. If you can win the fight in middle, it's... Oh, no, he's going to walk in. Glaive, this is such a hard angle to check if you're on the Chopper side. And now it's all down to SDY inside of the bomb site. 35 seconds. They're going to find him. Sip. Flashed or not, it doesn't even matter. And a one versus three now. They... Are, I mean... This is surgical. They're actually picking them apart in this round, tactically as well. Astralis with some incredible calls. <laughs> he tried his best. He made he made him work for it. 
But a one versus two now, and down probably. Here comes a little bit of a smoke setup. Let's see if this double mid setup from Spirit is going to be working out. Oh, they already spotted out one. They've fallen back off it. The Molotov fails, but it doesn't even matter. Sam Young, the only defender on this side, he spins around and realizes, wait a minute, they're in the bomb side. Magus with the kill on him, and now it's a two versus four. Spirit were not ready. This is looking like a, just an ever-improving Astralis here at the Major. Slowly warming up, but right now we have not yet found the limit. They are looking very good at the moment. Magus with the kill on Dexter. Magus on his own. He goes down to Lucky. It's 16 to 8. And Astralis, they win Spirit's map pick. <laughs> and fired up now. Yeah, Glaive is just willing it into existence now. This win. You're up.